Have you ever faced the nightmare of your WordPress site crashing? In today's video, we'll guide you step by step through the process of restoring your WordPress site using the Rapid Cloud dashboard, making sure you get back online quickly and safely. Hello, I'm Jade from Rapid, the high performance hosting your platform deserves. Whether you're a beginner or experienced webmaster, this tutorial will empower you to take control and safeguard your site against future issues. Before we jump into the restoration process, let's discuss some common reasons why WordPress sites crash in the first place. Understanding this can help you prevent future issues and recover more efficiently if something goes wrong. One of the most common causes is plugin conflicts. Sometimes updating or installing a new plugin that doesn't play well with others you're already using can bring your whole site down. Another culprit could be exceeding your hosting resource limits, which is especially common on shared hosting plans. High traffic spikes or resource-heavy operations can overload your server's capacity. Additionally, software bugs, outdated themes or plugins, and even attacks by hackers can lead to site crashes. It's a diverse digital world, and unfortunately, these things can happen to anyone. Now let's move on to how you can use Rapid Cloud to restore your site securely. Rapid Cloud not only offers robust hosting solutions, but also provides powerful tools for backing up and restoring your WordPress site. Let's go through the steps to get your site back up and running. First, log into your Rapid dashboard and select your site. Then, go to the backup section of the site's dashboard. In the backup section, you'll see all available backups with the date and time that they were taken, as well as their sizes. Click on the three dots for the backup you want to restore, then click Restore Backup. A pop-up will appear asking you to confirm the restoration of the selected backup. You can click on View Details to learn more about a particular backup. This can be helpful if you are unsure which backup is the best option for your needs. It's important to remember that restoring a backup is a destructive process, and you will set all files to their state when the backup was taken. This is very important for dynamic WordPress sites, as restoring will eliminate any sign-up, purchases or comments that may have occurred after the backup was originally taken. When the restore process is complete, you will receive a notification on your dashboard. And there you have it! You've just seen how easy it is to restore your WordPress site using the Rapid Dashboard. Remember, regular backups are our best defense against data loss, so make sure to set up a routine backup schedule with Rapid Cloud to protect your online presence. If you found this tutorial helpful, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more practical tech tips and tutorials. If you have any questions or want to share your experiences with WordPress restoration, drop a comment below. Thank you for watching and I will see you in the next video.